Have you ever heard of the Kuzarim? Yes. Okay, and the, the theory is that Ashkenazi people are from that group. And uh, do you know anything about it? Uh, um, and what do you think? I don't really know a lot about it. Uh, only from a TV show, uh, which was um, Avi Beatles show. I just looked. Look it was a comedy. They were making yeah, fun of it, right? Fun of it, fun of him. Um, it was. Uh, I was looking at it in Wikipedia, but I didn't really find something useful. Okay. I, I don't have a specific. Uh, well, the theory is that they're, they're a group from, that came from Russia and Turkey yeah. and that Ashkenazi Jews came from them um, and therefore Ashkenazi Jews don't actually come from here. Oh, no, I don't think that's... Uh, I don't know that theory, but maybe it's my ignorance. I'm not sure, but Ashkenazi refers to every Jew who is from the east of Europe, mm -hmm. Eastern Europe, so it's not specifically from Russia. Most of the Jews came from uh, Spain, this is what I know, and some of them are Ashkenazi as well. I don't know if it answers your question. <laughs> Have you heard of the group called the, in Hebrew, Kuzalim? Kuzalim, yeah. Uh, I don't know so much about them, but I heard it's like another part in uh, Russia or something like that. It's, it's a group of, of Russians and Tur Turkish people who converted to Judaism a thousand years ago. And they, um, the theory is, that according to some people, that uh, they are Ashkenazi Jews of today. And so Ashkenazi Jews don't have any right to this place. I don't know so much about it, so I cannot tell you anything. Yes. Have you heard of the Kuzavim? Yeah, that's us. That's me, actually. Okay, so what is your... Uh, this is a question that comes from outside of Israel. What is your opinion about the theory that Ashkenazim came from Kuzali? It seems, it seems uh, relevant. Uh, it's quite obvious that uh, uh, white, white Jewish people, uh, Ashkenazim from Europe, are not genetically, as much as I can tell, I'm not an expert, but they don't look the same like uh, Arab Jews, people that came from Arab countries, mm -hmm. uh, and Ethiopians. I don't think there's a lot of, there may be some genetic relations, but there's a lot of genetic differences. And uh, any theory that says that we're not uh, genetically come from the same ancestors makes sense to me. On the other hand, it doesn't make any difference to me because I don't really care where, where do uh, I come from. Uh, the, the, the main problem, the main issue for me is where are we going? And when I say we, it's uh, um, the workers. Okay, yeah, that's a socialist. Yeah. Understood. No, because this exactly question came, question. well, you can link it to politics, it's okay. But the question actually was about, because in the Muslim Arab world, they say if Ashkenazi Jews are really came from the Khazars, Kuzalim, if they came from that, and because they believe that all Israelis are Ashkenazi Jews, yeah. um, does that mean that none of us should be here? Well, it doesn't mean, for me, people are here. I was born here, I have nowhere else to go. I think people that are here have the right to be here. Principally, I'm, I'm, I support any person's uh, right to live anywhere he wants. Uh, uh, Palestinians were not here always. Jews were not always here. No one was always here. Um, and every people have the right to live uh, peacefully. And it is possible to live uh, harmonious, harmoniously uh, together. Um, but uh, there are certain forces, certain interests that uh, are against it. Uh, and we have to fight them together. Jews, Arabs, whatever. Uh, we can all live together. It isn't just, it's, not a, it's a conflict. Uh, it's a real conflict, but uh, it can be solved uh, on the basis of, uh, of workers' uh, power and uh, negotiation and dialogue. Um, I think, you know, I, I really... It's, it's, it's for, uh, for right-wing uh, Islam and a lot of uh, Palestinians, they have to understand that I have nowhere to go. I have no other citizenship. No one would take me. I don't think, on the other hand, that Palestinians have to pay the price for uh, Holocaust. It's not their fault. They did not do it. And they should not pay the price. And uh, settlements are, uh, are a crime. Uh, as opposed to what uh, Shelly Shimovic says, uh, settlements are a crime. And uh, especially the ones uh, inside Hebron, ones, the ones that are ideologically there and... Uh, are uh, straightforward, they're, they're, they're very obvious about what they want to do. They want to uh, uh, deprive the uh, Palestinians from their rights to, 
the peace and, and, and the prosperity and um, we have to fight this. We have to fight the occupation. Have you ever heard of the Kozalim? Yeah. Okay, so you've heard of that group? Yeah. Um, They've been uh, converting to the king converted to Judaism. That's right. So the question is, do you think that Ashkenazi Jews come from the Kozalim? My, some of them, okay. uh, but it doesn't matter because uh, everybody nowadays is a mixture of uh, many races and ethnic groups. And, uh, like the real Ju Judaism, the real uh, uh, sons of Israel uh, are, are very far back in history, so everybody got a different uh, bloodline. Okay, so you don't think it, it impacts or has any effect on the fact that we live here? Meaning, if you came from the Chazarim, you weren't technically from this Jewish line. Mm. You don't think it means it means anything? Uh, I don't really think it should be like uh, one day the world like can be more uh, more global for everybody. But now uh, nowadays, like uh, what do you mean, like the the, the rule of how do it called Chok Hashibut? No, I'm a, actually, because people in the Muslim world, they talk about this, that if Ashkenazi Jews come from the Kozavim, mm -hmm. so they're not actually related to the original Jews who were here, therefore they have no right to this yeah, land. I guess that uh, after they came uh, in touch with other Jewish, Jewish person, uh, it's all been mixed, and there's no, like, 100% uh, Kuzumian Jew over there. Also, it's more of a spiritual thing, you know, it's not... It's not uh, only a blood, like Judaism is not a, a race, like uh, in uh, Germany, the Nazis wanted, you to, wanted us to think. Like Judaism is a, it's a religion, it's a nation, a way of life, you know, like some, more of it. So it doesn't really matter. And, uh, and uh, actually, I don't know where, uh, I don't know who are the real uh, Jews, like uh, from the biblical days. Maybe they were looking very different. You know, like uh, actually in the Mediterranean area, I guess they were black, probably. Or very more. But do you think you're related to them as a Jew? Yeah, I think my, my mother was born in uh, Iraq, so she's in uh, from uh, Babylon, which which will, like uh, I think the most the most uh, old Jewish community are in uh, Ethiopia, Yemen, Yemen, and I guess also the Iraqi and Jewish. They are, they are originally ethnically uh, related to the real Jewish. And, uh, ironically, uh, they are getting here uh, a flyer, yeah, like... Uh, discrimination. Discriminated, yeah. But they are the real Jewish. <laughs> but okay, have you ever heard of the theory of the Kuzarim, the Khazars? Yeah. Okay. Sorry, what? You, you've heard of it? Sorry, I have to go like this. Sorry. Okay. Um, it's, it's a, the theory is that there's, there was a group, a kingdom a thousand years ago, that converted to Judaism in Turkey, Russia, somewhere around there, and that uh, they are the Ashkenazim of today, are those people. Which means that, that, that the Ashkenazi Jews never came from here. That's the idea. So have you ever heard of it, and what do you think? I never heard of it, but uh, it's true. The Ashkenazi Jews didn't come from Israel. <laughs> okay, so where did the Ashkenazi Jews come from? From East, uh, East Europe. And, but Ashkenazi Jews feel that they came from here before, no? The, uh, the answer is that... Uh, or do you, not, do you personally not agree? No. Shamat apam ala teore shela kezars, kezarim? שזה שבט אה, ב, של טורקים ברוסיה, חזרסטן, שהם השורשים של האשכנזים. There is a theory that Ashkenazi Jews come from a group called the Khazars, who are a Turkic people who lived in like Russia, uh, northern Turkey. And that's Ashkenazi Jews are actually not related to the Middle East, they're related to Turkish people. Have you ever heard this? Uh, no, never heard of that. Okay. Uh, I mean, obviously, if you look at the 
there's a kind of whole theory that the Jewish people are a race. So on one hand, uh, I guess you can kind of, you know, there is some like genetic similarities between like all Jews, like there's kind of Jewish genes and there's uh, Jewish um, maybe like diseases which are like inherited. But on the other hand, if you look at the physical appearance, which is like so varied in Israelis, then uh, the whole uh, argument that like uh, Jews are a kind of insular uh, race which never kind of mixed with other, other people, it doesn't really hold up. So uh, I guess whoever was in Europe just, uh, you know, had, uh, had a good time. Had a good time with other people in Europe and the rest goes for other countries. So everybody's mixed anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Have you ever heard of the theory of the Khazars? That um, the Khazars were a group who converted to Judaism about a thousand years ago okay. in what's today part of Russia and Kazakhstan. Okay. And, and the theory was, although there's no scientific proof, that they are the Ashkenazi Jews of today. Have you ever heard of this? Not really. Okay. Uh, have you ever heard of the theory of the Khuzarim? Khuzarim? Yeah. No. Okay, you never heard of it? No. Okay, they were a group of... Uh, Turkish or Russian, uh, it was a kingdom that they converted to Judaism. All right. You, you ever heard of it? Uh, no, I never, but you can... Okay. Well, the idea was that they converted to Judaism, and there is a theory by some people that uh, the Ashkenazim of today are those people. All right. So there's no, um, so there, basically there's no connection between uh, Ashkenazim and this land. There is no connection? Yeah, according to the, according to the people who believe the theory. All right. Um, I don't think it's true. Okay. I think uh, all, all of us Israelis that come from all over the world, mm -hmm. um, you know, they, uh, they came from our land fathers that lives here in the Bible, mm -hmm. uh, Bible uh, um, period. And after the, you know, the Gola and the the expulsion. The expulsion. Uh, so, uh, yeah. uh, I don't think it, there is a lot of. Everybody wants to be Jewish, you know. I think we are the. Uh, uh, I would say the Amani um, Fchar. The chosen people. The chose, yeah, the chosen people. Okay. Uh, what does that mean, the chosen people? Uh, that we need to lead uh, all all the worlds, all the the people in, in the world, the entire world, to be a good a good uh, people and. To have a uh, good life. Okay. This is this is why God chose us. Okay. Does that wait? Does the chosen people mean that Jews are better, or? I don't think we're better. Um, I think we um, we need to lead the other nations uh, to be a, a good good people. And, okay. and are we doing and, that? And create a, a better world. I don't know if, you know, this is a theory, I, I don't, I believe in God, but um, I'm Jewish, so I, I love being Jewish. Shamata al akvutsot, or a theory of the Kizarim, which is a kvutsot of Turkim, which are in a part of Russia or Europe, which are going to be Jewish. והתיאוריה שהאשכנזים של היום זה, זה הם, זה לא היהודים שאתה... המקוריים של הארץ הזאת. שמעת על התיאוריה הזאת? שמעתי על התיאוריה הזאת, תזכירי את השם. קייזר, קייזר באנגלית. אז היא אומרת בעצם שהיהודים, ש... שהיהודים שכאן הם כאילו לא יהודים מאמינים. זה מה שהרבה בעולם המוסלמי והערבי, זה מה שהם אומרים. אבל זה לא... תיאוריה זה שלהם? זה לא הגיוני. למה? <laughs> לא, זה לא הגיוני, כי היהדות באה מכל רחבי אירופה, יהדות ספרד, יהדות מצרים, המשפחה שלי גם, אני השילוב האולטימטיבי של מזרח תיכון חדש, שיש שורשים גם מרוסיה, גם מהקווקז, גם מטורקיה, והחצי כאילו, שני זה פולנים שעברו למצרים, היו יהדות במצרים גם, וכולם השתלבו כאן, והיו יהודים בכל רחבי אירופה, וגם... בכלל, כל הסיפור של גירוש ספרד, שהם הגיעו מ, כאילו, מספרד לאימפריה העות'מאנית, לטורקיה. אז השורשים היו בכל, בכל 
בכל אובר, התיאוריה הזאת היא לא... אבל בקשר ל... היא משלמת עם המציאות. אוקיי, אבל בקשר לאשכנזים עצמם, אם... מה אתה חושב על התיאוריה? אתה חושב שזה הגיוני, שזה יכול להיות? ואם זה מאיים על הקשרים שלנו, של הארץ הזאת? אני חושב שגם אם היו איזה ש... יש איזה קבוצה אתנית שכאילו... ש... רואה את עצמה כיהודים אמיתיים, אבל אה, אי אפשר להכליל את זה. כלומר, כל, אה, היו קבוצות אה, מאוד מגובשות בכל רחבי אירופה שראו את עצמם כיהודים עם זיקה למולדת ומסורת ארוכה שנים, כמו אפילו כל הישיבות האלה ב, בפולין או בליטא, שזה אלפי שנים. אז אי, אי אפשר אה, לנתק את הקשר הזה. Mm. כי זה הכל רשום, מתועד, ומסורת של משפחות של שנים. אז התיאוריה הזאת לא נכונה פשוט. 